Traveling West Virginia with award-winning photojournalist Brad Rice. I grew up always liking mechanical stuff, you know, working with my hands and stuff like that. I was about six years old and we went to Cass for the first time in Pocahontas County. Fell in love with the uh, old stuff, you know what I mean, the steam engine and the trains and everything. So I always tried to learn everything I could about steam engines and about the railroad, and, but never had like the money or the time, you know, put in for the big stuff or go any place and see anything. I did end up going back to Cass about once every year until COVID hit. And this is actually the fourth boiler I've built, the fourth engine. This is the fourth uh, version of, a, of your steam engine. Right, but this, this is by far the biggest. Dry weight, no wood, coal or water, anything on it, is about 4,500 pounds. Let's go for a spin. All right. New engines and internal combustion engines and cars and stuff, everything's internal. You can't see anything work, you just know it does work. But on a steam engine, you got all the valve linkage and everything, it's all, it's all external. You can see and you can feel everything that's going on. Our school puts on, every year, the entire senior class it has to come up with one project that they want to build. And at the end of the year, they bring them all into the gymnasium and show them off and they're all judged. Did anybody have any clue what you were doing when you rolled in with this thing? My friends did. Nobody else knew anything about it. Periodically throughout the day there was all kinds of people come up to me and said, I don't, if you don't win I don't know who will. And I, I did. I won best show. Now you're, you're what, a week and a half away from starting your job at Cass. I mean, that that's, what's that make you feel like? It's pretty accomplishing, actually, that, because, like, I knew I, when I was, you know, going through middle and high school, that, I knew that that's what I wanted to end up at. Well, they're hiring me as a machinist. Those engines are well over 100 years old, and when one of them breaks, you can't go to Napa for a part, and they have to take a raw piece of material and make a new part whenever one breaks from the ground up. If anything to do with that place and all those machines, I could do anything. I could just shovel coal all day. I'd be perfectly fine with it. Amazing work, Brad. Where do you think we should go next? Just let us know in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification to get the latest traveling West Virginia uploads delivered straight to you.